Let's uh, hit the mailbag. We've got a lot of mail today, and they got a lot of stuff in here. I'm looking at the headlines. Who are the right. headings for these. Uh, first one's from... Um, First one's from Brandon Melendez, and the subject is Tony, Call he- Tony Khan heel turn. What are your thoughts on – hello, Disco. What are your thoughts on Tony Khan possibly becoming a heel authority figure, much like Vince McMahon during the Attitude Era? Thanks. Keep up the great work. Not interested. Um, uh, next, you got any comments on that? Tony Khan heel turn, authority figure? No. I'm not, I'm not down with that. Yeah. He's yeah. too nice of a guy. He probably would get heat because he's getting like, like all this heat right now, but I just don't see it. Um, okay, here we go. Jared Aviat. Okay, here we go. <laughs> Ring of Honor integration is awful and Disco being called out. Hi, K100 fan. Thanks very much for, for, thanks very much for taking my question. Um, to Disco, stop beating a dead horse whilst worse than Will Washington's constant virtue signaling. I was, you were a hump. I was proven correct. Liv Morgan's slow character change to the dark side, which I was the first one to rightfully predict started way back at SummerSlam a couple months ago, finally took shape at Extreme Rules. You disagreed with me at the beginning and almost changed your mind more than once and then finally backtracked on your original comments completely after I played the Freddie Friends clip. Just face it, Mr. Gilbernetti, the rage and age is wise. On to my questions. I was a big Ring of Honor fan for a long time and I've always questioned why Tony Khan was ridiculously promoting Ring of Honor shows and using Ring of Honor titles. You think Tony needs to stop promoting the Ring of Honor brand ASAP? And does the crew think it further dilutes the AW product to continue to promote another smaller brand? When will this experiment end, do you think? Thank you, and that's best, Jared, even you. First of all, where, where did Jared, Ava, where did, where did you see the, the heel turn on Extreme Rules? She's still a baby face. And, and Ronda looked like the one that, that took the turn towards the heel stuff after that match. Plus, so, yeah, here, I mean, here's you, the you, other, you, but you, let me tell you. Let me tell he's you. suspended again from the email for, for mi- disinformation, okay, because he's completely wrong on this. All right, well, you can continue. So go ahead. Well, the other thing is that, bro, uh, Jared, or what's his name? Jared? Yeah, Jared Avia. Jared. Um, uh, dude, I don't think that's a, that's w- what they were thinking at the beginning. I think she didn't get over, all right? And now they're either, and maybe they're not even turn. either they're turning her heel or, which would be kind of dumb because she would be miscast as a heel, I think. And, or these rumors that she might be joining uh, Bray Wyatt, you know, but I don't think that was the end game from the beginning. No, it's bro. They don't. They don't do heel turns. It last five months. This has been a long time, right? Like, like and they try to say, oh, that's the heel. No, no, this is not. She's been. A, she's been a baby face through, you know, four or five different matches. You like, like feuds and stuff. Now, didn't you know, he have so something yeah. about Tony and ROH? What was the question? Yeah, why? Why does he keep trying to promote ROH? I, I have no idea. Well, I think it, the you know. the reason is because he's trying to get a TV deal. Why? Huh? Why? Well, I don't know. More money, but more well, more do you TV really think time. So I don't. I think it's well. The, the, he ain't gonna do it for free, so he ain't gonna produce a show for free. Disco. Let's get that out of the way. So you're getting more money, and number two, even though he hasn't done he hasn't done this wisely. You have another place for people to work at because dynamite it's too crowded and they right. don't do a good job in 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 uh, rampage. It leads me to believe they ain't gonna do a good job in Ring of Honor. That's why they have Chris Jericho with it because they need somebody with a name yeah, but the, but to show the TV, the TV right. networks. Hey, because the, TV, cause the TV, not- bro. Because here's the thing: if you put it on Daniel Garcia and you go to a TV network guy, they're gonna be like, "Who, bro? They're treating the TV network guys like they're they're morons." Hey, look, Chris Jericho is the Ring of Honor champion. Let's get a TV deal for Ring of Honor. It's like, no, the, 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 look at this going. Because a lot what? of times, yeah. because a lot of times, Disco, as you know, this at networks, if they don't know who somebody is, they look at your product as inferior. That's why star power is important. Well, that my, my point being is how dumb that they're, you're treating them like they're stupid. Like they don't know who Chris Jericho is. They don't know what Ring of Honor. Oh, look at like, bro, these no, people what I'm, know everything. What I'm, what I'm it's, saying, it's, what I'm saying is. What does it look more viable to you to come in there and say, hey, we want to start a new show revolving around Daniel Garcia or around Chris I'm, Jericho? I'm saying this. I'm saying this. Whatever pitch they make right. for Ring of Honor, the network is in the same. Well, bro, there's already too much wrestling right now. Why are we bringing up a brand that never that never succeeded to begin with? Why do you want to bring? Well, what? That's what as a network, that's what I'm asking them. There's right. already too much wrestling anyway. Why do you want to invest in another another show now? This does not make sense. And the, and Ring of Honor is a brand that wasn't very successful. Well, it seems so that's, to and, me. And, and, and I don't think they're getting anywhere with it. Okay. You know? It seems to me from what I'm reading that they want to do another show with them because of the. I'm, and that's my my point. It's a, That's a terrible mistake. 
It's a waste of time. It's a waste. It's like you're literally, maybe you had this fetish growing up that you were a Ring of Honor fan and you got enough super smart marks in your audience and say, oh, yeah, we need to get Ring of Honor back on TV. And like, yeah, let's do that. Let's get it on TV. And you go to the networks and they have no interest. And they right. don't have interest. And they well, shouldn't have any interest in, in the Ring might. of Honor brand. They might. Know? That's probably what he's um, trying to sell them on. He's probably uh, trying to go, look, these are my numbers in Dynamite and Rampage. And I think I can get you close enough to rampage numbers. And for them, that might be a big deal. You know, yeah, I don't, I don't yeah. know exactly what they're. Do you think it's a good idea? No. 